Hey Dio, I'm Avery Peck. And I'm Emma Claire Brock. Today we'll take a look at pop culture, showcase a few sports highlights, check in with our question of the week, and find out what it really means to go the distance. If you didn't watch the Oscars last Sunday, you may be wondering which film to check out next. Here's a pop culture update with all the latest movie info. Hello Delaro, I'm Matthew Brewer here for today's pop culture update. Today we're going to be talking about current movies, hottest rentals, and some of the top opening movies. The big name in the box office this last month has been the Lego movie, which has grossed over $275 million, becoming one of the most visited movies of all time. The Lego movie had remarkable ratings from critics, getting 96%, an 8.5, and 82%. Another animated movie, Frozen, also topped the box office with its touching story and lovable characters, because who doesn't like Olaf? Unfortunately, some movies didn't do as well as they hoped. The movies The Nut Job, Ride Along and Pompeii scored a whopping 55% combined. But what if you're looking for a good movie without leaving the comfort of your couch? The movies Gravity, Captain Phillips, and Rush are some of last year's top rated thrillers released to our local red box near you. Coming up in theaters next month are Mr. Peabody and Sherman on March 7th, Need for Speed on March 14th, and The Muppets Most Wanted on March 21st. That's all for your movie update. For Delaware News, I am Matt Berger. Thanks, Matt. Now, if you're like me, you don't watch films, you watch sports. Here are some recent highlights from our very own Delaware basketball team. Now whether you're a stellar athlete or just fat and out of shape like everyone else, you can start training to go the distance. That's right, the 24-hour relay race will be back this year to support our local schools. Our reporter Bronte Gould has the details. <laughs> What a great cause. Make sure to get involved, Eagles. Now it's time for the question of the week. If you can eat anything for the rest of your life, what would you eat? Children. They come in a wide variety. <laughs> I would have probably a nice warm croissant and um, a nice Caesar salad, chicken, and parmesan. No. Toothpaste. <laughs> okay, so I would eat steak with uh, potatoes. Potatoes? And some, some sauce. That would be it. Yeah, we're gonna leave that. Mustard. A lot of mustard. Lots of mustard. Kit Kats and Rolos. That's all for today's show. I'm Avery Peck. And I'm Emma Claire Brock. You stay golden, Eagles. Don't miss our. <laughs> <laughs> Don't miss our ball players. <laughs> Action. <laughs>
just move the info. Hey, uh, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> We're filming. Don't. <laughs> 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 you can do it. Don't miss our basketball players in action at the Sleep Train Arena on some... <laughs> <laughs> I was like, don't do it, don't do it. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Joey Arcaro, president of the Young Filmmaker and Broadcaster Club. Today we'll be having a small informational meeting talking about the direction we're going to take the club and some of the cool contests that we'll be participating in throughout the school year. Make sure to meet in 3.07 after school at 3 o'clock. I'll see you there.